ladies and gentlemen. Good evening and welcome to a celebration of the 10th anniversary of Dance for Daniel and the Daniel Morgan Foundation. Give yourselves a round of applause, please. are. Everybody has an opinion on his job. Everyone thinks they can do better and he has to turn up and be nice to Bronwyn Bishop every day at work. It's not easy. Now his office has sent me some notes by way of introduction. Tony Abbott has been the member for Warringah since 1994. His nicknames include Abbo, the Ab Blaster, Mr. T and Captain Lycra. He's a Piscean. His hobbies are boxing, flower arranging, blue tie collecting, crushing Labour leaders and knighting royals and... Oh, I'm sorry. I do apologise. There's a note here on the bottom saying not to be read out in public, Peter Credlin, so I am in trouble. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, will you please welcome to the stage the Prime Minister of Australia, Mr Tony Abbott. The Daniel Morecambe Foundation has been working to keep our children safe. And school children across our country now have access to resources, to material, to techniques to keep them safe in the face of the potential hazards that too many of our children face. that our children are safe and also that this state is a safe place to raise our children. For a decade that's exactly what Denise and Bruce have been doing, dedicating themselves to the safety of young Queenslanders and more recently to children right across Australia. Indeed is the launch, the official launch at the media conference of the production of a major movie titled, Where is Daniel? The production, <laughs> that's pretty special. Every man has his daydreams, every man has his goal. People like the way dreams have of sticking to the soul. Bruce and Denise are the first to acknowledge they could not have done this without you. Without people such as yourselves who come out tonight in Queensland's rather inclement weather to be here and to walk the talk. The continued generosity of Australians, some family, some friends, but mostly the majority, total strangers. I got thrown out of a classy hotel for knocking on all the doors, introducing myself as the new neighbour. You know, I'm really paranoid that people will steal my lines, so I never do my best stuff in front of audiences. Yeah. 